Hey guys, I'm from Super Reverie. Now, this is video two of three on my comeback, my comeback of the year video collection. Before I get started, this is gonna be the opening the mail video with a package from James Sanders. Before I get started, I did wanna finish some of the stuff I talked about in my first video. Um, I feel like it was very rushed. I'm sorry I didn't have a lot of time because I was rambling and I was excited to be back with you guys and gals. But um, basically, you didn't miss much. I, I mentioned price. I mentioned, uh, you know, a lot of things about it. You know, we'll get another quick look at both of the morphers. You know, just let's shush this one up. But yeah, you can get it. It's like the same as the regular Mystic Force Morpher. Nothing special. As you know, I'm waiting for the Japanese version of this. And this will suffice until I find it. Um, so yeah, I mean, I showed you everything pretty much. You just didn't get a lot of screen time on it. But there's some extra screen time, some extra love on the Korak Wolf Warrior Morpher. And I hear people all the time say, You're not 100% complete because you don't have Battleizers and you're missing the Purple Wand Morpher and the Snow Queen Udana. You're missing her Morpher too. My thing is like, look, if you're a collector, you collect within the boundaries of how you perceive it in your mind and how you want it to be. That's the freedom of collecting. We all collect certain things we want. I know some people who just get a lot of figures and they do a good job at that. People who just do Morphers. People who just do Zords. People collect their own things. My rules have I stated have I have stated millions of times is it needs to be pretty much close to screen accurate. Um, and if it's not on the Power Ranger show, I'm not gonna get it. I'm not gonna buy the Geki Ranger knuckle things because they don't they wear them on the show, but they never because it's Sentai footage, obviously being dubbed to American Power Ranger footage. But they don't morph using those knuckles. So I will. I'm a Power Ranger morpher collector. Um, I buy the Sentai versions because it's the screen accurate versions of the American versions, and they're very high quality. Um, I'm not gonna buy the knuckles because the the Jungle Fury Rangers did not morph that way. They used the sunglasses, you know, which I think are cool. People hate whatever. I like them, but it's all relative, man. Whatever you think is cool, do it. If you want to be a morpher collector and get all the battleizers and all the Sentai morphers, even though they don't apply to the Power Ranger series. Do it, man. But if I, for Udana, I never once saw the white morpher. She used her wand, right? So if I can go get a stick outside and put a nice little plastic star on it, hey, maybe I have Udana's morpher. Cool, I might do that. Who knows? Um, Korag, I never saw the wolf, the purple version of the of the morpher on the actual American. He never used that to morph as Korag. He turned to Korag in the purple, you know, the purple version. Now I did see um, Nick's dad. Spoiler alert. I did see him use, um, you know, the red version when he did that morph, you know, the red. So that's the one I'm after. That's the, that's that's my that's my philosophy. That's our for sleep in reveries Power Rangers Morpher Review Show policy of collecting morphers, and that's how I do it. You want to do it differently? Cool, man. I'll, I'll give you all the props in the world. Do it. Rock on. Just don't use your perception of what my collection is to say I'm not complete. If I say I'm complete, I'm complete, and that's complete in my mind. In your mind, it's a whole other story. You can go ahead and get all the battleizers and rock out, but that's not going to be me. Now that I got that rant out of the way, welcome. Welcome, everyone. You know, I'm just glad to be back, and, you know, I hope you can tell. Um, let's do mail time from James. Um, James Sanders, you guys know him. You guys love him. Super cool guy. One of my closest friends. We've kind of bonded over the past few months. We text every day. You know, even beyond Power Rangers, we text every day. Um, so this video is going to be an unopening. Now James um, was unaware that I had, well James knows I'm looking for the new key packs. And I did find one which you'll see in my next video, my, the one I'm going to do after this. Which is update on my collection. But I couldn't find, I found the White Ranger MMPR one. And you'll see that. I couldn't find the Super Mega Force Silver one. And I couldn't find the, um, the MMPR pack with the Green Ranger, with the Pink Ranger. And I know Angel's still looking... For that for me so angel if you find it thanks buddy but james sanders found the super mega force one and it's in here I'm not going to show you the front because i have information on it but james you know james doesn't have a lot of money he, he doesn't work because he has a disability and you know he's very you know very cheerful despite all this and he sends me things i don't have you know i have a lot of means to buy all this stuff and this is not to show off this is just to show my collection to, to the, the viewership. So thank you. I have a lot of means. I want something, I buy it. Basically how it works. I work really hard to get what I want. 
And that's how it works. James, who doesn't have a lot of means, gets me things I can't find. He sent me a titanium ranger, which you saw in my other video. He sent me this key pack we're about to open. So to me, in friendships, just just go a long way. You know, it doesn't have to be expensive. It doesn't have to be fancy. But when you do something that means something to me, whether it's money or not money, it, it will, it's an imprint in my mind that I'll never forget, which is why I go to my way. I wanted to get James a dagger. Angel stepped up, got him a dagger. Thank you, Angel, again for that. You know, it's not about giving people free things. It's not about the freeness. It's not, if you just want stuff, you, you're watching the wrong show. You know, it's about going above and beyond a friendship and showing, you know, things beyond money that go along way with me so that I'm going to go out of my way to help you out when I can. So it's about the, it's the moral of the story. That's the point. It's not about, you want free stuff. My biggest pet peeve are comments that say, hey, give me this more for it. No, I don't give people stuff just for no reason. That's the dumbest way to watch my show. If you just say, hey, give me this more for it. You watch my show to learn about Morphers, so learn how to collect Morphers, so learn how much they cost, to not get ripped off. Maybe if you want to see the silly movements I do, you watch them then too, or you see me rant like I'm doing now. But um, just to assume I'm going to send you stuff when I don't know you, you don't make a connection with me, we don't talk every day, we're not actually friends, you know, that's a rough sell. So make a connection with someone, man. And maybe you get something out of it, maybe you don't. But if you're looking to do it to get something out of it, then you're on the wrong channel. And I apologize if you have any misconception. But I'm not going to send people stuff just to send people stuff. I'm sending, I send James stuff and I try to hook James up because he is a genuine dude and really cares about being my friend. Same thing with Joey, Israel, Angel, you know, Maddie Cosplay, which we're, we're repairing that relationship right now as we speak. Um, thank you, Maddie, for that. But, um, you know, I, I do this... Not to just send people things. I do this because you guys actually want to make a connection with me and want to be my friend beyond Power Rangers. So that's why James and I have a connection on that level as 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 I do with the other people I've mentioned. So yeah, so let's get started. Let's open this up. Thank you once again, James. And I'm going to try to go look for that Trini for you. I'm going to get you a Legacy Trini, hopefully. Oh, nice. I love these notes. So yeah, these are the notes. So, James says, Chris, thanks for being such an awesome friend. Hope you like this key pack. I will have the money. I will have you the money soon for the Morpher. James is talking about the Legacy Movie Morpher, which he paid me. So, I, long story short, I'll mention this in the other video probably. I bought one from Angel. I found some at the store after I gave Angel the money. So, then I bought those two at the store and just told Angel to send James the one because James sent me money through PayPal. So, James doesn't get things for free. Angel hooked them up because Angel's an awesome guy. James has paid for everything else he's ever gotten. So that's why I don't mind hooking him up either because he's a good guy. He doesn't have much money. So when he does find the money, he pays his way. He's not looking for a free ride. So thank you, James. Thanks for this note, man. You're an awesome friend. Honestly, dude, you amongst the core people have checked on me every single day and it goes a long way with me. So thank you for the note, James. Here's the key pack Mr. James sent me. So sick. Translucent, you know, Super Mega Force Silver, Pink, and Blue. I have all these keys in their regular formation. Now all I gotta do is open this and add the puppies to the collection. Which I think I'll have a second to open right now, which I will. Nice little surprise on my show. We get to open them live. So let's do it. Super cool. And the Orion keys are always super cool because, you know, I have the regular version. Now I have the the translucent version, thanks to James. And I still kept the package intact. Nice. Because I keep the packages like Joey. It's a good idea, man. You got to keep the packages. So here they are. You know, you have your you have your Noah key, which is translucent blue. Super awesome. Super cool. I'm going mega. That's what the Morpher says, but... You know, so when you're Noah and you want to go into Mega Mode, Super Mega Force Mode, bam. I love the translucentness of this. Super cool. Then you have um, Emma. God, Masterson. She's awesome. Um, clear right there. I'm going Mega. You can do that too. Super Mega, for Super Mega Mode. And then you have last but definitely not least, Mr. Orion. Um... I'm gonna, I was going to say this for my other review, or for the review of it, but I probably won't do a review of it. But, you know, Orion, he does the, he does the, does this, and then he puts it, you know, he, 
does this and then he puts it in. Yeah, so then he closes it. Super mega mode. Yeah. And there's pretty much it, but there's the Silver Ranger translucent key. I did a mini review, a 10 second review of the American version, which is nothing. Doesn't do anything special, doesn't have buttons. Just has Orion saying, going mega, or legendary. So yeah, I mean, so yeah, there you go on that one. But yeah, so thank you, James. All I'm missing now is the MMPR Green Ranger one with the Pink Ranger on it, the solid Pink Ranger. James, you're the man. One more look at these. Thank you so much, buddy. Thank you for waiting. You sent me this like a week ago, but I just finished my finals today. And here they are. So at this point, if you're getting tired of my videos, I apologize. But it's been a while, so I figure I'd drop the hammer and drop three. If you're enjoying yourself still after all my ranting and raving, thank you. It probably means you like me, and I like you too, and you're my friend. So thank you for your support, and thank you for watching. But James, thank you for this key pack, my buddy. It's going to go in my key box. Um, I will cherish it. I cherish anything you send. And I got your back, man. I'm going to go to Toys R Us probably tomorrow. Got your back, bro. Thank you for having my back. You don't have that much money. You bought this. You sent shipping. You found one copy. You could have kept it for yourself. You sent it to me. I will remember that tomorrow when I'm at Toys R Us, man. Happy holidays, man. And thank you for being such a good friend. Honestly, man, you text me every day. You know, when I ignore the world because of law school, you text me to make sure I'm okay. Hey, buddy, how you doing? Hey, buddy, what's up? Hey, um, this is what's going on with me. What's going on with you? Beyond Power Rangers. So thank you for being such a good friend. Our friendship means a lot to me from the bottom of my heart, dude. You're on par with my boys. You know, Israel Parker, Joey Armstrong, Angel Council. You know, Maddie too. We're repairing that relationship, Maddie. Um, it's not gone. It's not at the level where these other guys are at in my heart, but we're repairing it. Um, and I'll respond to your email later on tonight when I have some time. So here they are. Um, thank you again for everything. Um, you know, James, you're a great guy, man. I'll let you know what I find. We'll talk, obviously, tonight. You texted me right now and asked what I was doing. I told you I'm shooting the video. So here's video two. James Sanders, mail time. Sending me some Mega Force keys. Thank you, buddy. May the power protect you. May the power protect everyone. This is video two of video three on the Arm for Sleeping Reverie Power Ranger Morphin Review Show Marathon. The Christmas Marathon. Sorry if I seem super excited, but I'm back. And I'm better than ever, I feel, in my opinion. And yes, and you'll get more updates on the future of my channel, as well as uh, frequency reviews if you just watch the next video. So, hate to leave you on a cliffhanger. Catch you on the flip side. I'm Stephen Reverie signing out. May the power protect you. Thanks, James. You rock, bro.